Hi friends, welcome back to my channel, Plus Size in Canada. I'm going to Costco and I'm feeling the Mickey vibes. I'm hoping that I leave Costco with something very special. Let's go shopping. back home you guys and I feel so happy right now I wanted this so bad I wanted this so bad and like it might not come across on the screen that I was like extremely even just to, like I have anxiety coming back now that I'm talking about the anxiety that I was feeling feeling thinking I was going to miss out on this like holy crap I'm getting anxious again but I I have nothing to freak out about I got it it's home I saw this last year okay last year i think it was the exact same maybe it was a little bit different but basically same idea and i hummed and hawed over that so many times and i just didn't pull the trigger i just couldn't do it um because it is i mean it was 134 dollars i think yeah 134 dollars 99 cents of pure Walt Disney World, okay? <laughs> oh, I got so many messages from people like, Miranda, this is at my Costco, keep your eye out. Miranda, this is at my Costco, keep your eye out. Hey, Miranda, did you see Costco's gonna get these in? Like, so many messages. And uh, like, I was like, I was starting to get rabies, like I was foaming at the mouth. Like, <laughs> I promise I'm, I'm not sick, I'm good, but like, Whoo! Okay, I, when I got to the store, first things first, I'm just looking for this. Actually, I was looking for something else too, which my store didn't have in yet, but I also got a lot of pictures about it. And Moncton friends, if you see it at the store, I don't even want to say message me because I already know I'm going to get messages. Like, maybe message me just to make sure that I that I know. But I'm looking for the, like the Pyrex dishes, the Disney Pyrex dishes. If you don't know, it's okay. It's just, I've got a lot of messages from other friends, um, especially friends from the States who have these Disney, and they also have Star Wars ones, but Disney Pyrex dishes. And let me tell you, like, I will make a trip in just for that. The second I get a picture sent to me, proof it's in town, I'm out of here. Like, kids come with me or not, I don't care. I'm going to get it. I don't even think they're that expensive. I feel like they're under $40. Anyways, I want that too. And I was looking for that when I got to the store and I was also looking for this. I walked through all the middle aisles. I looked at the front. I went back to the front because I thought maybe I missed it. And then I was like starting to panic thinking, <sighs> shit <laughs> I don't see it 
And then I, um, one of my friends, Fallon, hey girl, thanks for letting me know. She sent me a picture from the Moncton store. So I went back through my messages, found um, that exact picture. And I was like, okay, where is this picture taken? Like trying to figure out where in the store it was. And then from that photo, I could tell that it was further at the back of the store. And I went there and there was four left. There was four left. Four. Now there's only three. Actually, I think there might be less. If not, they might be gone. I don't know. Oh, I don't know, you guys. People with home decor these days, they just want all the home decor. And I feel like I'm not the only one who's heavily influenced by seeing the Disney stuff online because like I'm seeing it on TikTok, Instagram, friggin' well, I'm spreading it on YouTube. I'm part of the problem. Sorry, guys. <laughs> But I just like, I'm gonna get this out of the box. I'm gonna first do my haul and then we'll look at it together. Like, I know, I know that was like an expensive item. I know, but see, here's my, here's my reasoning. I always have like a good reasoning for when I spend a little too much. Okay, number one, I'm a Disney lover. Okay, so that alone makes me deserve it if I can afford it. And I work really hard, you guys. I work every single day. If you're here, just know it took work for me to get here. Okay, if you're watching this, like it takes work. Okay, Shh, don't tell anybody, but it's not always easy. Anyways, okay, so that is part of my reason because I deserve it. But also, we just got our executive check back from Costco. You know, when you have like an executive membership, there's some kind of percentage. I don't know what it is. I wasn't really listening when she was telling us about it. We had an executive membership before when we had a Costco membership years ago. Then when we got it back again last year, anyways, we were like, yes, let's just do the executive. And then, okay. So how much did I get back on that executive check? $135 not even shitting ya, not even shitting ya. So I was like, it's a sign, okay? Like God was like, Miranda, it's totally not God. I can't even say it, but like Walt, he's looking out for me and he's like, Miranda, <laughs> you can buy that just for you because you've done such a good job shopping and preparing everything for your family and taking care of everyone. Like you deserve something special. Okay, so I I buckled it in on the way home. I wouldn't let, Cooper was here. He was helping me bring the stuff in. Like, I didn't even question it. Like, I carried this in myself, two hands. Like, didn't bring anything else with me when I was carrying it in. Like, I part of the reason why I need to get it out of the box is I need to make sure it's not broken. Um, like, it's gotta be ready. It's gotta be like November ready. Cause yeah, we started in November in this house. Okay. <laughs> All together at Costco, I spent just over $400, $431.66, and I'm happy to. I'm happy to. <laughs> I did buy some stuff for back to school. A lot of people have been asking me when the kids start back. Um, it's next week. So um, it all, like, next week's Labor Day on Monday, and then, honestly, I don't know what day they start on. <laughs> Trust me, I'm a good mom. But <laughs> but we do something called staggered entry at all of our schools here. I think in New Brunswick, we all do the same thing. So like depending on um, where your name falls in the alphabet and what school you are too, you start on different days. So I think it's Thursday, but I'm not sure. So don't hold me to that. Like... <laughs> I'm going to find out. I have all the emails. I just, I went through them a little bit today. I, I am getting my shit together. Um, I did get some more school supplies today and I do have the lists for back to school, um, acquired. I just haven't gone through what I already have. I'm working on it. It's a work in progress, but yes, next week they start school. So, um, I did get some stuff with that in mind, but I think, um, I didn't get much with that in mind because, I honestly, like, we really needed groceries. Like, if you've noticed, I don't think I've done a grocery haul in a while here. We've been eating out a lot, guys, okay? Like, not gonna lie, straight up, we've been eating out a lot. We've been busy, and honestly, I could say that every friggin' day. If you need to eat out, don't feel bad about it. I'm sick of these people shaming people for doing something a certain way. Do what you gotta do to get through the day, okay? In one piece, mentally well, safe and healthy. Your kids are fed, they're happy, they're healthy, clean-ish, you know? No shame, no, especially mom shame. Like, pff, like makes me wanna say curse words, okay? <laughs> Anyways, okay, but now I have groceries. And guess who's cooking supper tonight? Me! <laughs> 
So I did get some stuff for back to school, but we needed some groceries. So I am going to go get some more stuff for back to school before the kids actually start back to school. And also we need to finish back to school shopping. So anyways, subscribe if you haven't already, because we're in for a great school year. I am declaring it with a little hesitation, but I, I think it can be better than last year, right? Yeah, I think let's hope for it. <laughs> So quickly, let's go through all of these delicious items. The hamburger buns were on sale. The hot dog buns were not. These were $4.99, so I grabbed that. I didn't get hot dog buns because, let's be honest, camping means too much hot dogs, okay? We're done camping, right, Curtis, right? I don't know. Um, $5.89 for three loaves of whole wheat bread. $6.99 for bagels. I just got two plain this time because normally we get um, one blueberry because Curtis and Cooper like the blueberry, but they were all out. So I just got um, two plain because Winnie's obsessed with a bagel with extra butter for breakfast every morning. Also got some one buns. I am loving tuna sandwiches on these. So freaking good. And I think I'm going to make some pita pizzas on those too. They'd be really good. $3.49 for these long and thick. <laughs> That's what she said. Cucumbers. Um, I think these were $4.99. Yep, for baby carrots. And I'm trying this broccoli for the first time. $5.69. It's two whole pounds of broccoli florets. Okay, like... That's a lot of broccoli. And Winnie and I love broccoli. I find sometimes when you buy broccoli, like cut up and packaged like this, it sometimes can take on a weird flavor. Not just broccoli. A lot of things can take on a weird flavor for me anyways. But I feel like this is worth a try for the amount you get. That's a really good value. I got some two bite brownies because these are Skylar's favorite. He's starting grade 10. Oh my heck. I can't believe he's starting grade 10. That blows my mind. Um, but anyways, I figured, you know, high school, take some brownies. Okay. <laughs> $7.99 for these beautiful big ass muffins. We got chocolate chip. We got blueberry. Um, $6.99 for this cute little pack of baby peppers. And look how cute these are. Sweet little gem hearts. These little tiny, look at the size. <laughs> I can't talk about size, it's too inappropriate. Um, but it's, <laughs> whatever, small romaine hearts, okay? These look so cute to me and I just couldn't leave them there. I had to buy those for sure. $4.99 for a big pack of blueberries, $5.99 for some green peppers, $5.99 for some delicious looking raspberries, and $6.99 for strawberries. We actually had this brand the last time we went camping. We ate these like day one. We ate so many of these. Holy crap, they were delicious. And these smell so good and they look so good. And they're also from Quebec, so that's exciting. I love something local. These are from Quebec too, I saw. Um, $3.99. This was a friggin' steal. I have been buying hummus in like little one size servings because I'm the only one who eats hummus. And if I buy like a regular package, I let it go bad because I can never eat that much in that short amount of time. Cause once you open it, it's like, it can get bad or moldy or whatever. Anyways. And plus <laughs> I should say, if I feel like it's been in the fridge too long, I won't even open it to check because I, I can't. I'll just throw it right in the garbage because it's too gross. Um, anyways, this was $3.99 for $16. What? I have been buying. This was the first time I ever saw them. This was the first time I ever saw these at Costco. The store is just so big. Holy crap. Okay, honestly... I have been buying these at Superstore and I've been paying like $8.99, $9.99, $11.99 for boxes like this with hummus inside. $3.99? Like, I feel like I'm getting ripped off now at other stores. Like Costco, man, they got good prices. Not lying at all. And not sponsored, but Costco, if you want to sponsor anyone, pick me. Pick me. Please pick me. <laughs> these right here are such a good value, $14.99. These breakfast sausages are bomb-tastic. And guess what? There's another layer under these. So you get for $14.99, two layers of two rows. And they're, th <laughs> I can't, they're thick sausages, okay? Like, it's bigger than your mama's sausage. <laughs> I got some more of our absolute favorite hamburgers, $6.99 for these restaurant-style french fries, which, my kids prefer these 
frozen. I don't understand the frozen fry. I don't. I don't get it. I really don't. But my kids love them. Winnie will literally have these as a bed night snack. <laughs> I don't know why that's embarrassing to say, but yes, I let my daughter have frozen fries for a bed night snack. <laughs> it just sounds weird. This was on sale. I love my Skinny Pop popcorn. It's absolutely delicious. Even though the name's a little diet culture-y, we don't need to listen to that. We're just gonna eat it. $4.99 for that. Their pencils were on sale and I did already buy the boys their favorite pencils, but on Winnie's um, sheet, it says right here, please note when shopping for pencils, we suggest the Stetelter brand as they <laughs> sharpen well and are durable. Dollar store pencils do not last. So here you go, you guys. Did tell a little tur. Yes, I graduated high school. I just, I'm dyslexic and I can't pronounce shit, okay? Um, anyways, these were $2 off, so I was glad to pick these up because they are the more expensive brand to buy at like Staples or Walmart or wherever you're buying your school supplies. But Costco usually does bring in the best brands for back to school. So that's why the last few Costco hauls I have included um, back to school supplies because I know it's a good deal. And even if it's like not the best deal, um, it's still a really good deal. So I'm glad, I'm excited actually. Well, saying excited is a stretch, but I am kind of looking forward. No, that's not it either. When we go through all the school supplies we already have, I will be excited to see that we don't have very much left to pick up. There, yeah, that's exactly what I meant. Speaking of, I also got these beautiful colored pencils for the queen, $7.99. I definitely know I probably could have bought these cheaper, but look, they're fun and they're rainbowy, and I know she will be excited to see this, so yay. I got some Pinty's Classic Crispy Breasts. We love these. I've got off them for a little while, but now I'm back on them and I really like these breasts, okay? <laughs> $16.99 for those babies. I got some cheese it's $11.99 for 36 pouches. Um, Skylar makes this for himself all the time, and this pack was $9.99 for 22 pouches of soup. That's 22 meals for my teenage son for $9.99. Good deal. Um, $8.69 for some Nest Tea. And of course, you know, Miranda's gotta have her rum in DC, okay? $10.69 for that. Then I also got this big giant hunk of beef, $27.56. I'm going to get my hands real dirty and separate this up here in a few minutes. And then I also got some pork tenderloin. And these are like big packages. I think there's actually four tender, I think there's two, yeah, there is. You can, this, okay, it looks gross. So I'm going to start doing that. But there's two tenderloins in each side. And that's actually how much I like to cook in my crock pot when I make pulled pork sandwiches. So there you go. Slap all the meat. Slap all the meat. <laughs> Life's too short to take it too seriously. Have fun and slap some meat, baby. <laughs> Look at these. Whoa. Are those perfect? Yeah. Uh-huh. What the? It's my toy. You got a toy? It's a, it's a big head on your back. Wow, that's so cool. Yeah. out my supper you guys i have a classic 90s clubhouse sloppy joe and then i made myself this cute little salad i'm gonna go enjoy this and then we'll say bye <laughs> okay you guys we're gonna say goodnight <laughs> we love
love you guys very much, and we will see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye. Bye.